Hi everyone. So I'm here today to share a journal with you. This journal is a uh, prayer writing journal. It is not decorated. Um, I've used, I've altered a book cover. I've added this um, lace um, fabric to it, like a netting type thing with a design on it. Um, the book was, I think the book was like a brown colour um, and I put on few coats of gesso then I put some acrylic paint and then I've sealed it with some this stuff <laughs> uh, that gel matte medium it takes more of that <clears throat> um, made a simple topper the kit is mainly um, that I used is from Tsunami Rose and then there's just loads of different papers coffee dyed papers vintage papers go through that in a second um, so I'm just going to give you the measurements of the journal because this will all be listed um, in my shop and you get all this with it as well. So it measures eight by five and a quarter, has a one and a quarter inch spine. It has a hollow spine, is that what you call it? You know, you can see right down there, so to speak. Um, and I've got obviously the, the fluffy stuff on there, cheesecloth. Um, there is three signatures, 140 pages front and back. Did I just say that? I can't remember. Um, anyway got some stitching on here let's do a quick peek of this so i've just put some um this was a digital from arty maze actually and then i backed that onto some cardstock because i wanted a good sturdy um like solid bit on the cover um the papers that i've used i said they're from um tsunami rose her uh, prayer journal kits and positive quotes kits and um, this is from some uh, vintage ledger fingers aren't working there we go. And this is like a really thin paper. I'm going to try printing on that. I've got no idea the weight of it, but I've got loads of it. <laughs> um, coffee dyed paper. This, I don't know what this is. It's some form of um, bookkeeping type thing. Um, another <clears throat> page there from Tsunami Rose. So yeah, I'll have this listed on my coffee shop. I will have a link below. Um... And I'm going to do a single signature one. Well, <clears throat> actually, that's what I'm working on now. Just thought I would do this video. So there. So it's kind of ready for you to do your thing in. Do your thing in your journal. So I know some people like that. They like to. They like the blank journals, and then they like to dress them up. Um, this is the middle signature or the second signature. Again, we've got them pages from Tsunami Rose and uh, old lined paper. Again, this and that. You know, if you like where this is quite white, like here, oh, where is it gone? Where is it gone? You could simply ink that up with a little bit of this if you don't want it to be as that. Or if you're going to choose to write on there, it's not going to bother you then, is it? You know, after all, this is a, a writing journal. If anybody, um, like, obviously, if this if this sells and anybody wants one, just give me a message on the my coffee shop. Send me a message on coffee shop, and you know, if you want one, then I can make you one, uh, and I can possibly do a little kip uh, with it. But I will let you know if you message me just what I have available at the time isn't it so yeah so lots and lots of pages to play with 140 front and back oh still more it's never ending so that's the journal um, I've got another I've got loads of book covers um, another one here because i'm planning on doing a blue one um next this was obviously a an oval um gonna do that one right what you'll get with this as well is this little stuffed envelope and the paper that i've used to cover that is from arty maze and it's called bella bella rose is it bella rose bell rose bell rose sounds like mel rose doesn't it <clears throat> so inside here you have got i've done some stitching on there we've got tags 
there's three tags there. All f um, the tags are actually Artemis, and the images are from Tsunami Rose. And I kind of, when I was printing them, I kind of printed them a little bit more than what they were, um, <clears throat> a little bit higher. So we've got uh, some of these library cards. We've got these notes. We've got this one, Honor and Eternal Life. We have that, and God is Love. He heals the broken hearted. And then I've just made a little booklet, not book. It's not decorated or anything. It's just for notes using um, like bits and pieces that I had left over from making the journal. For some of them pages that I have, they're enormous, like lengthwise, they're really long. So I get a got, I, I get a got, <laughs> I get a lot. Of good use out of them, I get a go. Um, yeah, so that's that, <clears throat> and obviously that all goes in there. Then I've put a um, god, there's quite a lot there, it's probably well over 100 little like mesh blings. Then we've got some nice trim, I think there's about a meter of each if not more of some of it maybe slightly less and that one's maybe about slightly less yeah because it's oh i don't know you know i don't know you know a yard maybe and i'm not good with <clears throat> i go up to about like 12 inches and i can go up to like 21 cent centimeters but when you start talking any more than that i've got no idea what the length is <laughs> so anyway um <clears throat> that's when you need to get like you know the husband's measuring tape out because my ruler only goes to 12 inches <laughs> anyway so there's that and that then this big wide one <clears throat> there's lots of that as well because i have lots of it so there's that and that's in the way and these are actually i've coffee dyed some of these and they're really good this one has got a little bit of a pink piping to it let's see mm, maybe just short of a meter like i said there's there's quite a bit <laughs> to play with then there's this little bit like that's definitely not that's probably about just over <coughs> excuse me that's about 12 13 14 inches that is then there's this now this has got um like I don't I've got loads and loads of this as well but it's got slight like coffee marks on it or like so you know it kind of changes in color maybe it's supposed to look like that I don't know so and I what I do with this I I literally make it go um twice as it I get more use out of it because I kind of cut it right up the middle then I've got two lots if you know what I mean um so there's that and then there's this a little bit of pom-pom trim cut the pom-poms are quite close together and again that's probably about 20 inches that then there's about two meters of this <clears throat> fluffy eyelash trim and i've just put a little bit of that around it because you don't want that getting all tangled up with everything else there's a little bit of pink ribbon as well because obviously there's a lot of pink going on in the journal and um like obviously this little ephemera ephemera bit um so yeah so this will be listed over on my coffee shop and <clears throat> the link will be below i've got a few more um i might do a few of these little packs to put up you know as cheap as chips sort of thing um <clears throat> Sorry about that, I keep like clearing my throat. It's very windy today and I've had my windows open. Obviously the fresh air is amazing. I love fresh air. <laughs> um, but the the pollen is quite high. So yeah, that's all what you get in there. So yeah, I might do a couple of these little stuffed envelopes with little notebooks um, um, with different colours because I've got... Um, the pink prayer kit the blue the the orangey color the purple the brownie colored one like a light beigey color there's loads of different colors i think i don't know there might be a green one as well i can't remember so i've got them all they're all from tsunami rose check out tsunami oh i have to, i think i need to change the link to her shop actually because she had a lot of hassle didn't she and she um <clears throat> she had to start a new 
make sure to start a new one so there we go all that will be listed in my shop any questions just ask um and like i said if you wanted something like this if this if this one goes and you want one then just send me a message on my coffee shop okay so have a great day and i'll speak to you all soon bye for now